Being LGBT doesn't really feature in my practice at all. If it's just me kind of exploring my own stuff, I like to do landscapes and flowers, up close flowers, I still do a lot of those as well. I like to look at the details and the colours and I go big, go bold. The way I create my artwork is I'm an intestine pattern maker. I, I love patterns. My work is paper folding. And so I have to identify those patterns that could be uh, folded into three dimensional reliefs when you shine lights on it from a different direction, or if you turn it the other way, it's always transforming. Generally, the art world is quite welcoming, and you can meet some really nice people. I would definitely say the art world is a welcoming environment for the LGBT community. I can totally be myself in the art world. I can be as crazy as I like, I can be as gay as I like, I can be as straight as I like, depending on what mood I'm in. I'd say I do feel like a part of the LGBTQ plus community, and particularly with my gender identity as it was something that confused me for a long time and it stressed me out a lot. I do also receive a lot of support from my non-LGBTQ plus um, peers and friends and family. people there is a long way to go. I have friends who are transgender and I know that that every single day they are fighting comments, threats made by strangers. I've known people that have been beaten up outside of train stations just for dressing too gay. I've had comments off of people before bisexual isn't a thing and this is coming from people who are LGBT themselves they think you're either confused or you know you haven't decided yet. I think we have come on quite a bit, but we just have to keep pushing and make sure that it, it doesn't matter. Like everyone accepts everyone for who everyone is.